I'm asking you a legitimate question. Is it? It's a yes or no question. Would you still believe him if you victimized one of your family members? Yes. Okay. All right. So last night, my buddy Tin Foil Straight Jacket, shout out, and I, we went into Archaic's Discord server, and we wanted to kind of pick their brains about why they believe in simulation theory. And on this channel, I've exposed how that dude was convicted in the past for some serious charges, aggravated sexual assault. And listen how fast this guy answers, man. He just instantly says, yes. Would you still believe him if you victimized one of your family members? Yes. So that's what I've been talking about lately on my little series called The Dangers of the Online Truth Communities. These people get swept up into a cult of personality and they don't, they don't care what these people do, what their morals is or anything like that. They just want to hear uh, sweet nothings whispered into their ear. I've covered this guy in a few other videos before, and you can see those go through the archives. Or I'll have a couple cards that pop up at the end of the video. But I get his errant fans come in the comments and they say he's very open about serving 26 years. I don't see the issue. So the issue isn't that he served 26 years. The issue is that if you watch the video where he talks about what happened, he lies about what happens. He says it was a kidnapping charge. And he make and in the story, like the friend's name changes a bunch of times and everything like that. Like, it's not a very believable story. He's telling this story with all these details, and then he gets up to the event, and he's like, well, I don't know what happened. Her clothes were off, and anyway, I dropped her off at the police station. It's just that part gets glossed over. To me, if he had just said a lot less, if he had just said, man, I did something horrible, and I'm not even proud to admit it, and, you know, I'm a changed man, that would be a lot more uh, fruitful to me and show more remorse to me than him lying about it, what the charge is, because kidnapping and aggravated uh, sexual assault are two different charges. I went into the server acting like I was some guy that donated money to Jason and I was mad because I was trying to see if they would defend the sex offender charge. And the one guy, the same guy you hear say yes, his name was Phoenix Protocol in that server. He he literally said, like, how do you not how do you know that that's not a Mandela effect? The government website with the, that shows his charges and everything. He said, how do you know that's not a Mandela effect and stuff? But he believes all this other stuff, he says. So that's what I've been saying lately is this dude's like forming a cult basically whether whether he knows it or not the people falling in line are very cult-like and unquestioning i'm going to play the entire recording of when we were inside that voice chat it's about half an hour so i'm going to play that for you guys i'd love to hear your comments and the the people that are his fans they call themselves the errants and they say they like vibrate higher than everyone else they vibrate so high this like phoenix device won't wipe them out when it returns in 2040 or whatever <laughs> but by the way these guys act you can see that's clearly not true because he was you know quick to ban me and just freaking out and he wasn't able to control his thoughts a lot of what they tried to do was like figure out what we believed rather than defend their own worldview that they said they believe a um, member members see it first uh brit and the members said wow this is stunningly scary on so many levels thank you for posting christina said wow that was a shit show tina marie said crazy on so many levels and i agree so let me just play it for you and then i'll be back right after i told jason on the phone i didn't give a shit about any of this i'm a history major man all his information all of his history that's all i've ever cared about that's it that's why it's legit to me that's why he's giving out for free he's handing everything he's done more than anybody's ever seen okay and i'm gonna choose to give him the benefit of the doubt because this system is evil the entire friggin system is evil I don't know what happened. So I know he told the entire story of his kidnapping thing. Everything is dead. His friends did. The girl that was there, he took he took her to the cops. Everything's written out. How do you know that it? that's real? How do you know he's not lying? How do you, then how do you know? How do you, because because the police him. report reads otherwise. He and said it was kidnapping, you. and the police report says aggravated sexual assault and a yes, lifetime registered sex offender yes hold on, hold on. He, wrote, he wrote every he got lied to at 17 years old he wrote every single detail out how do you friends, know that hey, hold on hold on hold on guys hold on. hey hey hold on guys so what's what's the verified account like what's what what's it what what are you accepting as verified uh, what is it phoenix phoenix protocol well, what are you yeah. accepting as what are you accepting as verified account for what his misdeeds? Like, what's the uh, where do you where do you where are you getting your information about him doing what he did? I, 
Because he's told everyone. And get, see, that's no, the no, problem. I'm, Let me tell you something. I don't care. Let me tell you something. Y'all, this is the problem yeah, with the world. Y'all don't uh, trust anyone. It's always – and I fully, fully believe in what I'm I told not, you. I'm just, I'm just asking you a question, I know man. that. I'm but I'm, man, I'm not mad at you, man. But oh, this dude's worried about money and shit, man. I like Jason. I'm sorry. You're not going to sit here and do this. I, I've talked to him on the phone personally. Okay? I know he's a good dude. I've been back and forth with him emails. I've known him for six months. Man, all of his information plays out. Everything resonates with me. All of it. He he has like an hour long in the beginning of a live stream. I'll find the damn thing. I, where he I saw the video. Those happened. guys made a video. Those same two jackasses they made a video they jason were... explained the whole thing jason yeah. explained all listen, and i listen I don't trust him Sorry. listen I, I don't need those Man. two jackasses made that damn video with him on top of the general lee and daisy dukes and i was mad now, when what I watched the video, I went and found another video where they caught him in a lie. He said the guy's name was a different name, and he said it oh, was a kidnapping, and he news. didn't say it was Are a you damn sexual assault. Okay, you know what? How about this? Don't come to me then. Why don't you email him? Because I guarantee oh, oh, you. Oh, I'm emailing will... him. Trust me, and I'm going to get back my $450. Go ahead. I'm on Go social ahead. security. This is elderly abuse. Nice. And I'm calling the damn attorney general tomorrow morning. Okay. You do. You got to do what you got to do, my friend. This is a scam, brother. <laughs> it's a scam. He's a he's a convicted. He's a con man. He's a con man. Let me, let me, book that I've never seen anybody else bring out, they all check it's out. It's just I books that, that he read. It, he me, read a book. So me, what? Let me, Who cares let me, that he read a book? Can I can I get a word in? Can I get a word in? Yeah, go ahead, man. Go ahead. So I I, I kind of get the the poems here uh, with Drew talking to you. Drew very much talking to your Phoenix. So let me ask you some things. If somebody did something terrible to to your family members? Would you trust them with uh, information if they had some like secret? If, if someone victimized one of your family members, would you trust them to tell you about the secrets to reality? Is that is, I'm just trying to like get perspectives here? On, Yo, on, on, I've, I've never. Would you would you would you trust that person, bro? He. I, I'm choosing to listen to him and trust, and he's been open this whole time and honest, and he talked about no, it. I, no, okay, no, I'm, no, I'm, listen, I'm I'm asking, I didn't feel the need to go look and see if he was fucking lying or not. I'm a trusting person at first. I said, you like, got I got finagled. All, but all his data checks out. All I care about is history. You're not listening. Oh, right. And the history, he <laughs> lied. Listen, you, I'm not going to get... Listen, PP. You can't... Hold on, hold on. Hey, hey, hold on, hold on. Pee -pee. You're wrapped up in the wrong thing. That's what I'm Wait, telling you. On. One last what? thing no, I have to say, PP, to PP. Pee -pee. And I'm not going to yell. Listen, I'm serious here. <laughs> if he didn't tell the truth about something from 30 years ago, why should I believe him about something from 1,000 years ago? Okay, then don't. But he's that's caught in a lie I mean, from 30 years I mean, ago. I don't know that's, what to tell you. You know that. That's kind of not a... That's, that's, I mean, I mean I'm then not trying go. to stir the pot here. I'm not trying then to stir go. the pot here. Like I said... Stir the, I'm hey, listen, I'm not trying to stir the pot. That's a, good, that's a good question. That's a good question. And he's I'm telling lying. you, I care about his data. All the history that nobody's brought out, everything that done everything all the shit that it has it doesn't matter what he's done other people have brought it out it has nothing to do with what he's done in his past all every so, bit of all of his data that he's found it has he, nothing it, it doesn't matter what he did you look at all the books it's what? other people that brought it out what if he, he, now his so he thing shows, said shows, he said his victim right. was 19 what oh what God, if the victim what crime Don't could he me. commit and you would just forgive him what if he genocided he just, 500 I've people i've checked all of his sources but i don't if, need to oh, let's say i he, don't need to listen to him anymore all i've done is look up his book so I've if he killed up, 500 oh, people oh, and oh, ate oh, their oh, hearts oh, then no oh, then, oh, then oh, you oh, don't oh, care phoenix oh, hold on you never answered my question would, would you believe him if he victimized one of your family members 
Oh, I don't, I don't do that. Like I said, y'all are completely in the wrong perception. Y'all have no clue. You're, you're in the, I'm the at, wrong I'm perception. I'm, at, I'm, at, I'm asking you a legitimate question. Is it? It's a yes or no question. Would you still believe if you victimized one of your family members? Yes. Okay. okay. Yes, well, you're out of your it. damn yes. mind, boy. You're not listening to me. Okay, well, I, I just wanted to hear that. You, I'm, I'm you, you answered the question. You just, you're done, boy. You oh, I don't care about you, bro. Please, please, man. You're please, done, you, boy. You could you, sell out your own you, family members you, for a you, nugget you, of a, you know, from a propaganda you, book from a hundred years ago. You would sell out your own infant. Don't fuck yourself, dude. Please leave. You just said you would. You don't need to be here. You just said you oh, would. Hold on, hold on. You're, you're not listening to me. I, I heard you. you. I, I checked all the sources, you jackass. They're all legit. There's nothing that he came up with. I'm lying about so it. So he guys. read a book? Check the book. What the fuck is wrong with you? He didn't write. Listen. There's other people. Hey, hold on. Hold Listen. On, hold on. We don't need to be. Hey, I can't. I can't hear you when you're yelling. Still okay, Calm down, every, every snapper. Look at himself. Look at all the sources that he's ever brought out. So he. Hey, please say it wrong. What please sources? Say it wrong. Hold on, hold on. Listen. Hold on. Every, to hold on, man. On Can you guys website. quit yelling? Go to his yeah. website. He has every single book he's ever read. He's given everybody, every single person. I have them all. I have like 5,000 pages of all of his handwritten notes. Does that mean. <laughs> Does that mean that the, none of these books were propaganda? They were written by other people. You can all go find these okay, sources. Okay, but does that mean okay, the book on. is real, or is the book a narrative or propaganda? Uh, uh, did you, you have to decide that for yourself. It's by okay. fucking scientists, authors, okay. old people, okay. different people. Man. But how do you know the Hold book's not okay. propaganda? Hold on a second. Hold on. You have to have discernment, man. Sorry, man. Can you stop yelling? Can you please stop yeah, yelling, man? man. I, I, I can't hear a word you say when you're yelling. It's just muffled. Okay, I want this please. dude let's to just leave. Calm, let's just calm it down. It's just like a point for point, please. Point for point. Okay. Um, all right. Where where were we now? Just one point at a time. People, people please stop yelling. I, I um, apologize. Oh, okay, so. So what? I had a question. I had a question, please. Just a question. So, if if the framework is, uh, you know, we're living in uh, a simulation created by this AIX, this virus AIX. Okay, what is Aiden. the stop? What is the stop AIX from from convoluting any sort of material we find to be true or free from its uh, sort of. Uh, I don't. Uh, what, I mean, what's, what's the word? Perfect. I'm not saying so, I agree with anything he said as far as that. Right now, guys, but, you're not letting me finish. Let me finish. I don't what, care about his my, theories. What, what my point is, is if, if we're living in a sort of simulated world created by some, some evil sort of malevolent uh, 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 archetype, that why, why, is, why is the information really available to us to figure him out? I don't understand that. If if this world is created by such a powerful entity, why is the information available to our caves to, to figure Guys, it out? I don't understand say, that. Part. Let me help you out. Let me try to explain it a different way. Okay? He was in prison for 26 years. He ran I didn't the library. Ask that. I didn't ask no, that, bro. I'm trying to help you I understand. Can I say it, please? Can I say this? Fine. He went, to pri he went to prison for 26 years. Okay? He became a librarian. This is the, he's told all this story. He's talked about the kidnapping. Okay, in prison, he could find books that we cannot find. I've talked to other scientists, and they have they can't find these books still. Like I said, every single one of these books he's found in every one of the Texas Library prisons. Okay, not him. He found. He wrote notes. He data mined everything. He cites every single one of those books he's found and read personally. Okay, now that's up to you. To go find those sources if you don't believe what he's found and written in the books and 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 that are those sources like i said you are arguing with all the books that he found everything else but, everything but, but, he's came up with yes he has theories i don't agree with everything that he says we can debate that i'm just saying is, 
He only cares about his data. He only cares about okay. the books that he found. Okay, okay, but, but what, I, what I'm what I'm addressing is uh, it's an epistemological uh, thing. Where yes, how I does he know. know? How does he know this thing when he's cre- when he is pr- when he's hypothesizing theory about simulation about an all powerful simulation that's created a reality as we know it? Like what I'm looking around me myself right now as to not be real that. AIX doesn't doesn't convolute uh, the material he's sourcing himself. That's what I'm asking. I'm okay, asking a epistemological yeah. question. How does he got, know that what he's saying is true? Okay, he doesn't. That's why he said before he doesn't. He doesn't want okay. people. And I've talked to him about this. He doesn't want people getting wrapped up in his theories and all okay. this stuff. He wants so people he to look. Know. He, he wants, doesn't know. I've told you things are debatable. I'm trying to tell you he's he's found. He wants everybody to look up the sources that he found. He wants everybody to do their well, own his research. Sources. His he's sources. Saying, all the 1,300 books, he's used an educated decision, and this is what he's come to. This man has read and but, written. But he's you're, he's you're, a you're, not missing, you're missing my. You're missing the question. You're missing the question again. Okay. I'm, I'm, you're, you're missing it because if AIX he's, provides all the materials in the world of knowledge, and he's – Sourcing the material from AIX, does that not mean that his information is rendered invalid because he's no, sourcing no. it from AIX that's providing no. it to him? Okay, let me, let me help prove you. Prove it otherwise. Prove it otherwise. Okay, because he believes in the benefactor. He believes that when well, all these things – when all these things happen, if they, if there's all evil, there has to be good somewhere. People actually literally trying to help us out. And what he thinks is that – and this is only theory. He's got a lot of theories. Everything. He's not absolute about everything. Obviously not. You're trying to take absolutes, and he doesn't have them all. Things can be different. But he believes yeah, yeah, the benefactor. Yeah. He believes yeah, the benefactor yeah. took all the information and brought and took all these books and hid them underground. Whenever the elite leave, and they leave during before the phoenix – they and they take all this information down to the ground. And yes, he can change. The Mandela effect is changing stuff. This shit can all change. He he knows all this stuff. That's why he said y'all need to go read the sources of books yourself. He's only making an educated again, decision again, of all the books he read. Again, you take, we're going we're going back to books and sources, but you don't you're not you're, you, you're okay, completely you missing my you're completely you missing my point again. You don't absolutely know. Nobody does. Yeah, Nobody. yeah there, there's no epistemological thing going on here. For, you, you know, if AIX controls everything in the system, it controls right. the information you're sourcing too. Okay. So but do how, you not, how do you it? not agree that that's a, that's a problem? In no. Theorem? That's not no. a problem. That no. AIX no. Could, be, could be. Well, I wish I could get some help. I wish I could get some help here. Please, Lori. Do you not do you not realize that that's an epistemological problem for you? No, because you, I when told you're you. This? No, I can tell you're not you're not listening to me. I'm, uh, I'm listening. You're, you keep telling me to source the books and source the books. Well, Where yeah, else you gonna get those information? Books. Where else are you gonna get information to try to find the truth? Where do you go to find the truth? Uh, yeah, yeah, what, that's, what are you, you trying know, to you, find? You, what brings no, no, you here? What, but what, what brings I'm, all of you to this? This part of the internet, out of everything you've been searching, some out of you have still come out. No, 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 no. What I'm is asking that, you is I'm asking you're, you. the, you're the one that's adopting this what idea that AIX search? controls the here? world. I don't adopt that. What are you adopting? Don't. Adopt, I don't adopt that. I don't adopt Good. that this world is, is some uh, simulation. I don't adopt, I don't adopt I'm happy simulation. for you then. You don't have to be here, yeah. man. No, one, but, yeah, no, no I, why can't I ask you questions? Why is that a, because, a big problem for you? Because you're not understanding anything I'm saying to you. You don't understand what I'm saying to you. You're not, yes, you're not I understanding. do. Absolutely, I do. That you know. That's why so I want you to leave. Absolutely. He. Wow. If Go he's ahead, Zora. If, he, if he's explaining what he's been citing, he's been following Jason's work, then that's what he believes in, I guess. I don't know, man. I don't know what are you trying to find and even no, no, creating what, an argument. What, why are you what, creating an argument in something that you don't even believe in yet somehow you're in you no, come I'm to this part of the I'm internet? I'm questioning your beliefs. Is that okay? Or are you guys just the, are not okay with that? I'm well, a, I'm I, a, this is a cult ran by a sex offender. I think it's a, some type of simulation or something because my point is I come from here because I started looking into. Uh, a plane or dimension of flat earth 
Let me say something. I'm trying to ask you. Disclosure program. Do you believe in Do you believe in aliens or do you believe in a religion or what? Y'all just what? hung up the sex offender thing. No, That's it. What? So you no, can. No, no. What I, what it's what the only thing I is... can prove. What I'm asking <laughs> you is, jackass, you won't listen. Go ahead. I'm sorry. What I'm what I'm what I'm asking you is, guys. I'm asking because I'm on your Discord server, and I'm on. Uh, you know, you guys have uh, a, a sort of perception of reality. And I, I'm, 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 I'm simply, you. I'm simply questioning you. what you believe. Okay, I'm is that okay? Me. Why does it? Nothing has to be predicated on why, what I believe. I'm You're talking to Z, you brother. You're talking to Z right now. Well, I'm not, so what I'm, what yeah, I'm asking, asking you is, I want to try and understand and see your way of thinking. So I'm asking, what is your? You don't need to. You don't need to understand. You don't need to understand my thinking. You don't need to understand my thinking. I'm trying to figure out your way of thinking. You don't need to understand this, brother. You don't need to understand uh, my point of view to defend yours. Is that exactly. is that what you say? You need to understand. Uh, I'm trying to defend, defend it. I'm trying to see if we can find a middle ground because yeah. if you believe in a religion no. or a Jesus, we're, no, we're, no, we're no, you're just me into your to, belief right now. I'm worried, worried about the sex offender. I gave Dude, money to not, a sex offender. I don't give a shit about you, bro. You need to leave. No, I gave money to a I'm, sex offender, and I feel I feel jilted. I felt I believed it. I wanted to help him. I had nothing to do with that. Go I, email him. I tried to help him. It just seems like you guys just keep like uh, like sidestepping my questions, man. It's really weird. Well, I've answered I believe, it. it. I believe it is a simulation. Okay, a weird okay, so, simulation so for the I, evolution of like an eternal soul or eternal being. Okay, so how do you how do you know any? I mean, how do you know the reason a why? That, like I said, that I believe it is a simulation was because I didn't know what we lived on at first because I was trying to figure out is it flat or not because the ancient you know NASA Hebrew means a deception and all space information comes from NASA, which is a private organization controlled by people who who knows could be trying to create a reality whatever you want to call it do you call it satan or do we call it like a programming to try and stop eternal souls to figure out what they are and keep it trapped i don't know is a purpose okay. like okay. suffering okay, i don't that's, know that's fine that's fine what if he put what if he put how come i can't see how come i can't see polaris from australia but you can see it from the northern hemisphere but if it is a ball or a plane how come i still can't see that star no matter what if we're flying through space that one star shouldn't be staying in the same spot okay that's, that's if, all fine danny but i'm still i'm still my question simulations. i'm if he put five children in a meat grinder would you still believe him you only care about what happened in his past because he lied me. about so if he there lied you. about I'm it just, then everything uh, else he's lying wow he lied what? about what happened, so why would he li lie about everything so, that he read yeah, and really, did? I really don't want to block okay. you guys. I okay. don't. I really don't. So, I'm trying what I'm, here. What I'm at, what I'm asking is how. Okay, so so uh, who is the other gentleman that's on here? Uh, Zorion. Okay, uh, so Zorion. Uh, Zorion, excuse me. Um, so what are the parameters of this? simulation that you believe so you you're able to think outside of the simulation is that what you're claiming I'm trying to figure out who created the simulation because okay. I'm, like i said i've only just come so to what this are, conclusion what are because of my research into flat earth and it's kind of come down to here okay found this okay. part of so, the internet so, so that's not, that's what i was asking that's what i was asking phoenix so that's a, it's a it's an issue with like how we know things is what i'm interested in so how, if, if you're claiming uh, a paradigm of the world is simulated, which implies someone has coded this simulation, and mm -hmm. which also implies everything within the simulation has already been predetermined, mm -hmm. which also implies... Yeah, there's two realities. Which, which also implies all of your thoughts are limited. Okay. No, there, because there's always, you can't possibly... Always... You can't possibly think outside of the simulation to view the simulation because you're in the simulation of course you understand what I'm saying? this is a, this is an, 
This is a, an epistemological, uh, logistical nightmare for you guys. I love to, knowledge, To try man. to address that. I just I love, love knowledge. knowledge. Fuck, that's man. What, I just... 1,300 sources. Go read all his books. All I can tell you no, is that... No, not his books. Uh, I'm just... The stop, books... Stop coding, listen, forget the... Forget the, the... Forget the charges. Stop, forget the crime. The I'm not worried about the crime. I'm not worried about the crime. I'm going to not gonna talk about it. Where, dude, Hold on, bro, right. Mr. We believe in the bro, simulation. And bro, the call it. Limited, speechless limited, broccoli. Hold on a second. The conclusion of right. it being limited and how we're able to break free to even think like how this. How do you know that? How do you say. know that? How do you know that? It's how we're saying. How? Where do you go to find your truth? Dude, where do you find your truth? Again, again, because you can't answer my stuff. You can't just turn around. But this, like, you uh, can't I, answer I, a question I, with a question. I'm telling you, I got my information yeah, and I looked up all the sources yeah, and that's okay. what Wait, now I got a question. I'm, I have a legitimate Why are you yelling at me? I have a real because, question. Listen, guys, I've explained this so many times. He's he's making an educate I'm just most of my shit I'm repeating right now is what Jason has come up with. I know. He's read thirteen hundred books. Guess. He's 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 published in all he's a published author six books so far about to publish like twenty fucking more okay so he's coming to an educated guest with all this information about the only way we can find truth in this world is by the written word okay and not just the Bible okay whoa, so whoa. he's making his, he's, he's his, his from written, the history he's found history he's found all the history that they did not tell us and they stole fine. from us all that's fine but I'm asking you still how do you know you're not in a simulation bro how I do don't, you man. I'm at, you don't. What do you want me to say? We're trying to what? figure it out. I don't know 100%. No, what, 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 what I've been what seeing you know, through then? all these different what? theories is that is, it is the human mind trying to come up to how we can get back to a source or a creation and therefore but can't get past the theories it. he's created. And then yeah. nothing can be yeah, explained ever just... because they're all trying to explain the same thing and yet they're getting lost into their own different yes. paradigms and create an I... argument. You're hung up on one thing. I'm not, man. I'm just trying to find knowledge, man. No, just trying to figure out. I'm not hung up on one thing. I can't. You're dead in your tracks on one thing. Inside the simulation, you can't know. Empirically, you can't know inside the simulation. Jason says it. So, so how does he know? You've just. how does he know? You've just. You've just rendered your whole Jason's whole entire fucking argument moot. What? It's a theory. No, it's just, just a spirit. He, 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 he knows it's going to be no, wrong. It's, it's what? false. You're not listening. Right, okay. You know what? Go look at all the other books he's talked about. He's talked about informed field. Energy. You don't care about anything. Care about else. Books. What's in What? One listen, thing. Listen, how do you know damn, that the books. God damn, listen, man. How do you Which know. A, how do you know research the books is, are not them, propaganda that he read? I'm done. How do you know his books aren't propaganda? Does that mean like the Bible and all that? Does that mean it's a product of AIX that we could say from our perceived reality and that it's nothing but bullshit too? If you believe in the Bible, I'm still trying to figure things out, brother. I'm still trying to figure things out. Nobody's even said anything about the Bible. I don't know what you want me to say. Nobody's said anything about the Bible. Even as a point of reference. I don't know what you want me to say. Okay. One, one, one. I have one question. He doesn't have absolutes, guys. He knows that. He's been honest about all this shit you're asking me, so go look it up. But how he do says you know that the book that he oh his thirteen hundred books? How do you know the books are like now? Oh, yeah. Wait, listen. Now today on the you're internet, so hold on. Let me. I'm not yelling. <sighs> I'm not talking about crime. I'm. I'm asking a real question. You have thirteen hundred books today. They have TV and internet to push propaganda. How do you think they push the propaganda he before that? He doesn't, he doesn't use the internet. None of his data. Uh, uh, he says so, specifically yes. he, all from his books. So Holy. how do you know that that book is not propaganda? Because they've you been pushing know. propaganda go forever. Go read it. Ask me yourself. Go read it. Figure I thought it out they're only in a prison library. I can't get it. I'm not going to commit oh violent God. sexual assault to go read a book. That's why he found them all for you, That's dumbasses. Why, is that why he committed the crime? Dude, you're done. Is it? You're done, dude.
I'm done I'm, with that shit, I'm man. asking the question. You're so, you're so low vibrational, I can't deal with it anymore. I can't. Well, I gotta use, I use the bathroom. I'll be right back, guys. I'm asking if you don't know that the books could be propaganda. So at the end, the guy basically, he ultimately gets triggered because he want, he says, you need to go read the books that he read. But he also said earlier in the conversation, these books are only available in these prisons. If you listen to Jason's account of what happened, he, he says when that happened, he said, my life is scripted. So what he insinuates heavily, I believe, is he insinuates he went into prison for you so he could read those books and bring that information to you. He read 1300 books, so it was all the victim, it's everything else, just forget about that. He read these books for you. And I almost had him, he was ready to, he knew he had to admit that next when I said, is that why he went in there, you know, to, to read those books or whatever for you. And he just couldn't say it out loud because he knew and that's why he, the guy had to ban me at that point. So I'd love to hear your comments on these errants, the most high vibrating section of the truther community, what they think. Uh, let me know what you think in the chat. Do you think Archaics is legit? Do you think he's onto something? Or do you think he's a con man? Uh, light up those comments. Let's let them know.